PowerPoint gives you the ability to add sound to your presentation in several different ways. Let's take a look at our company overview presentation and practice inserting sound. We'll start by inserting our own sound file. I have some music I want to play on my title slide while the audience is waiting for the presentation to begin. First, I need to make sure the slide I want to add sound to is selected, and it is. To insert sound, select the Insert tab and locate the Media Clips group. Click the drop-down arrow on the Sound command and you'll see a menu of options. Select Sound from File from the menu. The Insert Sound dialog box appears. My sound file is stored on my desktop, so I'll just locate it and select it. Keep in mind that PowerPoint doesn't accept all file types. MP3 and WAV files are two common audio file types that PowerPoint does accept. If your file isn't an accepted file type, you can usually convert it. Once you've selected it in the dialog box, click OK. Another dialog box appears that asks whether you want the sound to play automatically when the slide is loaded in the slideshow view, or whether you want the sound to start when the sound icon is clicked in the slideshow. I'll just click automatically. Now a little sound icon appears on the slide and two new tabs appear on the ribbon when the icon is selected. You can click and drag the icon anywhere on the slide you wish. If you switched to slide view right now, the icon would appear on the first slide. You probably don't want that, so luckily we can change that setting from the Options tab. Just click the box next to Hide during Show in the Sound Options group. You have many other options on this tab. You can click the Preview command to listen to the sounds that will play, and click the Slideshow Volume command to change the setting to Low, Medium, High, or Mute. You can choose to loop the sound until you stop it. I want to do this because I don't know how long I will need it to play. Or you can change it from playing automatically when the slide loads to requiring that the icon be clicked to start the sound. Now when I click the slideshow command, I can see the sound icon is not visible and I can hear my music playing. As I move to the next slide, the music will stop. I can just press the escape key to return to normal view. You may be wondering why the Picture Tools Format tab is available. Well, the icon is a picture, so you may decide you want to format it to make it blend with your presentation colors, if you plan on having it visible during the slideshow. My guess is that usually you won't need to do this, but PowerPoint does give you the option. Now, if you change your mind and you want to delete the sound, just select the icon and then select Delete on your keyboard. Like what you just saw? Rate it. Add a comment. Subscribe to our channel. The freedom to learn. What you want, when you want. Absolutely free. GCF, learnfree.org.